Hey guys, your cut 4 hour chart. We are looking at bearish setups here with beautiful bearish delta pattern. Let me just get the pencil loaded. In just a second, as we can see on the um, scanner here, 4 hour chart in your cut is already showing bearish momentum. Weekly and daily and monthly, yes, still pushing upwards, but that doesn't mean we cannot enjoy the shorter moves. Which brings us to the 4 hour chart. Uh, where, as we showed before, we have a beautiful delta pattern and the hidden divergence is already forming. Whether it's going to be from the absolute top or we take the previous highs here, doesn't really matter. The hidden divergence is in place. Which means we can go ahead and say, okay, hidden divergence on the higher time frame, check. Now let's see if we have any levels around it. And the first one will be the field 38, which on its own, it's not ideal. Uh, in my opinion, this is a very strong level and this one as well. So if I go ahead and let's just remove these drawings and put the actual line there, we can see where those levels are, right? So something like that. We have the spikes and the closing prices. So assumption here is we can be pushing slightly higher as well. So in that case, I'm going to say price is not near a level yet. Uh, higher time frame divergence against, yes, there was a corrective divergence here, which now having the other divergence is already invalidated. So you can either leave this one as neutral or select it as uh, no here as an X mark. And that all being said, we can see that this is a medium setup at the moment. Um, it is still tradable, of course, we just need to make sure there is a very strong level on our side. We can go through one hour chart here as well, where um, continuing divergence is already forming. This is also, i just remove that for a second. This is also a double wave, okay, and 100% was already cleared. In other words, you can see where 161.8 is pointing. It's right there to the level we marked manually. And that's why uh, knowing how to draw and spot levels manually without any indicators, pure price action is really valuable skill, guys. And it's it doesn't take much, okay, just a bit of practice and I'm sure um, you will become very, very good at it. So, um, again, it confirms that the level is not exactly there. On the 15 minute chart, we already see first divergence that was formed. We see here the second divergence that was also formed, okay, which was not picked up by the indicator. But, uh, technically speaking, if we see break below here, we can have already first entry. All right, now since this is slightly more aggressive, having a close below that zone, especially below the 100% zone, would make it much more valuable to me. All right, because then we know 100 has been cleared and we're getting false break of it. On the other hand, getting just a spike here and holding above it means we're very likely to continue towards the next level. And in fact, if we go ahead and uh, draw the fibers again, you'll see that this zone is exactly in between the 50 and the 38, right? <clears throat> right here. So that would be my idea about your cut looking, definitely looking for sales, uh, at least in the short term. 15 minute chart, possibility here to be attacked of course and let's see let's see thank you for watching